Bloomberg Chat can be exported in TXT, MSG, or XML formats. For all three formats, the raw export results in messages that read like this. This chat takes place across four days and 23 participants. It's not a particularly active chat, but there is a lot going on that is difficult to read. There are seven different actions that can take place in a chat. Four of these actions can add a lot of content that is difficult to review. Those four are entrances, exits, disclaimers, and history views. Entrances, history views, and disclaimers often happen together when someone joins a room. The substance occurs in the other three actions, messages, invites, and attachments. Let's render this chat in a more reviewable and helpful way around those three actions. Here's the same chat reformatted to optimize review for substance. A participant summary groups the participants by the firm they belong to. In this case, we have borrowed names and associations from the show Downton Abbey. The participants are color-coded by firm with a summary of the substantive actions. Counts are shown for messages, attachments, and invites for each participant. Below, only messages, invites, and attachments display. Of the 400 actions in this chat, only 70 are messages, invites, and attachments. Reading this reformatted version, it is much easier to identify what's been discussed. The summary is interactive, so you can focus on a particular individual's actions in the chat. You can highlight a firm, multiple individuals, particular action types, or any combination. We also create a version with all seven actions, which can be used at time of production. It is stored under the same document record, so coding only needs to be applied once. Below the summary, the chat also displays entrances, exits, history views, and disclaimers. Using these two views of the same content, you can quickly review and fully produce.